The Constitution provides that the House of Representatives shall have sole power of impeachment. We're impeaching Joseph R. Biden for abuse of power and even bribery, treason, misdemeanors, and a widespreading spectrum of inability. Sir, you're about to be announced the next president of the United States. Why am I finding out about this now? We have to be sure, sir. I understand. Sir, the polygram machine determines the accuracy of your sincerity. My actions determine the accuracy of my sincerity. We require all answers are met with a green light. A red light would forfeit any impeachment this time. No red lights, sir. During any time in your career, were you aware that Joe Biden was allowing his son to influence the domestic policy of a foreign nation? Are we impeaching Joe Biden or Joe Biden's son? No, I wasn't aware. A rigorous investigation practicing explicit measures found Biden guilty of voting fraud leading to his presidential win. Are you asking me or telling me? Did you partake in the cover-up of election fraud leading to Joe Biden's presidential win over Donald Trump? No, I had nothing to do with such claims. Final question. By withdrawing American troops, Biden gifted Afghanistan forces and their Taliban accumulated $83 billion in U.S. weaponry. Guns, ammunition, tanks, helicopters, education, and intelligence. Did you advise Biden against his decision, stating his actions were incompetent and detrimental to the safety of our country? That's a question, sir. Yes, I did. We are 100% in the clear. Yes. Congratulations, Dwayne. The people of America are about to meet the 47th president of the United States. Not so quick. This isn't a win. It's a disaster. A disaster how? Well, is it not self-evident that he's unfit to be president? Excuse me? He's too smart, and he tells the truth. That's what the American people deserve, someone who can tell the truth. But that's what the people of America deserve. How are we expected to trust you when you're so damn honest? What do you suggest we do? We have to, you, have to follow trends. These days, presidents are like rappers. They need a criminal record to be taken seriously. Like Eminem. No, a real rapper. Vanilla Ice. Tupac. No. The Notorious B.I.G. No. Biggie Smalls. Still, no. Biggie. The Notorious Smalls, Biggie I.G. G. The Big Notorious Smalls. The Notorious Biggie. The Notorious Biggie Smalls. We're all the same person, you imbeciles. Even Vanilla Ice? We forgot Fred Durst. Who's Fred Durst? Uh, he's the lead singer of Nirvana. That's David Grohl, you fucking idiot. Fred Durst is Linkin Park. Then who the hell's Kurt Cobain? Kurt Cobain's the fucking drummer of the Foo Fighters. The silence! We've got to go bigger. More scandalous. I've got it. Julie, you said earlier you could sue me for sexual harassment. Does that offer still stand? I was just being a cunt. But you still could sue me if you really wanted to, right? I mean, sure, if it helps. You think in the Bill Clinton, Monica Lewinsky fucking uh, 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 that jabby thing? Yeah. We've got to go deeper. I know. Anal. Perfect. I love anal. Brilliant. Karen, have Chief of Staff order me a strap on. I'm sitting right here, sir. Would you kindly order a strap on for our Vice President? Sure. What did she say? She said sure. I'm sitting right here. I haven't moved. Tell her I said thank you. He said thank you. Before we announce Dwayne as president, we need to make sure that he has all the same likable qualities as Biden. How do we do that? Let me prove it. Ask me some more questions. <clears throat> Have you ever sniffed the hair of a woman or child like a perverted creep? Before you answer, sir. Best interest that you answer it. Yes. Okay, even if the answer is no. I see great lies, sir. Yes. Creep sniffing is right up my alley. Come on, Green. <laughs> Shit. God, it's like the light detector knows he's lying. Look at me in the eyes. I need you to lie from the heart. From the heart from the heart. Like a real politician. <clears throat> um, 
Do you have any leads to the KKK? Yes. Fuck! 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 Why not? Ask him again. We don't have time! Have you ever won an election using fake votes or signatures from dead people? Yes. Fuck's sake! Fuck! Fuck! Fuck. What kind of politician are you? I'm not sure if you're getting this, okay? We can't trust you if you keep telling the truth. Have you ever said any dumb shit during a speech that didn't make any sense? Or farted in the presence of royalty and acted like it never happened? I don't like the fart word. Yeah, I don't like the word moist. So what do you suggest I say? Well, my nephew says boom boom. Sir, have you ever boom boomed in the presence of royalty and acted like it never happened? Too far. No, oh, that's sick. You can't go around asking questions like that. Have you ever jerked off at work into a sock? What? The strap on dildo is being shipped. Wow. Nice pick. Answer the question, Dwayne. Have you ever jerked off at work? Into a sock. Think very carefully before you answer this question, because I've had it about up to here with your honesty. Yes. Yes, I have jerked off at work into a sock. Whoa! I knew you were jerking the Gurkha next door, big guy. Put it here. You did good, Mr. President. And I've got the footage if we need it. What? I have... I have a stash of, um... CC footage. And I, I can't confirm that, uh... Mr. President has an amazing cock. <laughs> in, in case anyone's... <clears throat> wondering. So you're telling me that in our possession we have footage of our newly president masturbating behind closed doors at the White House. Into a sock. I... I collected the socks too. Well, what are we waiting for? Post that shit! I'll give you a TikTok login. I'll put the socks on eBay. <laughs> a sex tape. Congratulations, Mr. President. I can rub one out now if it helps. Hey, no, 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 it's okay. Oh, no. It's okay. It's okay. Yeah. It's okay.